مرحبا Hey everybody, what's up? Welcome back. This is Rosalie Reacts. Welcome to the Ultimate Reaction Channel, checking out music from around the world. Today's shout-out goes to Kais Hayuni. Thank you for your suggestion. Told me to check out Balti and Hamuda. Now, those are two different artists. They, own, have, they each have their own YouTube channels. Millions and millions of subscribers. I'll put links in the description below. But they also do songs together. Balti featuring Hamuda or vice versa. No. Okay, that beats dope. This is hard to watch. I don't think we need to understand the lyrics to know what's going on here, huh? I love that beat. Such a little kid, he has a good voice. Clean. That's awesome, they're collaborating. It's relatable, y'all. Oh, I love this, man. I love this. Such a sweet kid. Millions of followers, y'all. Millions of views. Okay, okay. Hey, hey. Okay, yes, you guys. Thank you. That was a great suggestion. This song, you guys, check this out. This song is called Yalili, featuring Hamuda. It's Balti, uh, it's on Balti's channel. Balti has 6.24 million subscribers. Hamuda has millions as well. And this song that they did together, Yalili, uh, came out in 2017. So it's been out a few years. 746 million. Oh, over. Okay, over 746 million views. I've said it before and I will say it again. There are artists out there that we have no idea about, that we haven't heard of ever, that we don't listen to, that have millions of millions of views, just as big as Beyonce, just as big as Christina Aguilera, just big as, as big as uh, Ariana Grande. But it's simply that it's not familiar to us because it's not on our radio, it's not on our charts. And I think this type of things are great reminders that the world is so much bigger than we realize. Some of the things we argue about, some of the things we're consumed by, are small compared to the grand scheme of things. And that can be overwhelming, it can be humbling, but it can also be encouraging that there's so much more to explore. So welcome to my channel, subscribe if you haven't yet. 
Have you ever heard any of these artists? Some of you are out there in Saudi Arabia. Welcome. Some of you have been watching from Egypt, from Morocco. Welcome. Havari, which is Swahili for welcome. Marhaban. Thank you guys. You are amazing. 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 I, uh, my goal was to get to a hundred subscribers within the last week and we've made it far beyond. Thank you guys so much. But I loved that. I loved that beat. It had that, um, Ah, it, it was just awesome. It had that, uh, um, a little bit of that reggaeton vibe to me. Um, and I, I, I don't, I don't know if y'all realize this, but a lot of times you can find those elements. You have those, um, Hispanic reggaeton vibes or those beats we know from reggaeton and from Hispanic music. You can find that in a lot of Arabic music or vice versa. I mean, nowadays you can combine it all, right? You have, you could have African drums and elements, um, added to classical music and to a lot of strings and flutes. That's something I love to do, combining different elements that are more unconventional and creating something beautiful and, and, and cool. But that beat that was going with this was hard. I don't know what the lyrics are saying, so let's check that out. I think the, the storyline of the video kind of spoke for itself, right? Obviously. And mm, whew, it's good I'm not super emotional today because I, <laughs> I could have started crying on that too. Just because it's relatable. We, we know, many of us know what it's like when parents fight. I, I had that. It's, it's hard when parents are arguing and there's fighting going on. That's what it started off. And I thought that was kind of the theme. And then it turned out that it was more about the, the dad being abusive. Um, and a parent being abusive, not feeling safe in your own home. I know what that's like too. I understand. And I can relate to that. So those type of things get me sometimes those type of things can be, uh, a trigger. Now I got to figure out, hold on real quick, y'all. So we're going to figure out a little bit about what the lyrics are saying. If you understand, if you know what this, uh, what these lyrics were saying, would you please leave a comment below and let me know? I want to understand what I listen to and I'm going to be able to tell you, but I don't speak Arabic. A sad and small in my heart. We love to fly. Um, they like to cut my wings. Your child suffocated. You're asking for my forgiveness. Hovering between countries. Huh? Help me out, guys. What is what are they singing? What is he singing about? That little kid had a, a, a good voice, like clean, nice, sweet. Just really cool how he's doing his songs and how so many people are listening to it. I'm having a hard time even through Google Translate to figure out what the song is really about. Would you leave a comment below? The theme in the video itself seemed like this kid struggling at home, domestic violence, dad being abusive, him going to his friend, his adult friend. And that was so beautiful because there's so many kids out there, even adults who need mentors, who need someone that can listen to them, that can stand by their side, that they can run to. Having experienced domestic abuse, um, having it through, through, through family, through a parent, having, um, experienced when your own home doesn't feel safe. It's so beautiful when you have someone you can run to and cry with and lean on. And this dynamic of this adult male being a mentor, a father figure, a big brother to that kid, it's just beautiful. But I loved the voices. I loved the, the, the beat on this. That was a really dope song. And like I said before, you guys, we don't know how much music is out there that has got millions of views and we don't we don't even know about it. What did you guys think? Do you guys ever listen to to music like this? Do you like this song? If you are from an Arabic speaking country, please help me out. Leave a comment below. What is it about? What does this song mean to you? My question of the day is, who is your mentor? Who is a close friend in your life that you can run to, that you can that supports you, that encourages you and cheers you up when you're down? Maybe you are that person to somebody. Maybe someone is that person to you. Leave a comment below. And that brings me to my Insta inspiration. Insta because you can post it on Instagram if you like, but also it's instant. It's a quick little inspiration. From this video, my inspiration is let's lean on each other, have a friend you can run to or be that friend to somebody else. You guys, I appreciate you. Subscribe, leave a comment, share. Thanks for stopping by. This was Rosalie Reacts. Until next time, ayo. Hey